Hey there traders! Are you ready to take your trading game to the next level? What if I told you that there is a perfect MACD strategy that has a cheat code? Well, you're in luck because we have a strategy that is going to blow your mind. And the best part? It's easy to implement with just a few clicks. This strategy is close to the holy grail as it yielded profitable results every single time. If you are interested in knowing what strategy it is, then don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe to the channel for more amazing contents like this. First up, we need to add some indicators to our chart. Don't worry, it's not as complicated as it sounds. We're going to start with one of the most popular indicators in the game, the Moving Average Convergence Divergence or MACD. This indicator is a game changer when it comes to identifying momentum and trend direction. We're going to focus on momentum for this strategy, and with a few simple adjustments to the settings, we'll be ready to rock and roll. Next, we're going to add the Alpha Trend Indicator, developed by Kavanch Osbiljic. This indicator is going to help us minimize stop losses and overcome sideways market conditions. It also provides accurate buy or sell signals during trending markets, making it an essential part of our strategy. And last but not least, we're going to add the Super Trend Indicator. This powerful tool is fantastic at identifying trends in the market using calculations based on the average true range of price. With a few tweaks to the settings, we'll be ready to go. Now that we have all our indicators in place, it's time to dive into the nitty gritty of the strategy. We'll be looking at valid buy and sell signals on the five minute time frame of the Euro USD. And trust us when we say, this strategy has the potential to be highly profitable. But before we get into the details, let's adjust the settings for these indicators. For our main indicator, bring up the MACD settings panel. On the input, change the time frame to 10 minutes. Then head over to the style. I want you to uncheck the histogram, then change the style of the MACD to histogram. Change the color of the zero line to mint green, then also adjust the style to line. And that would be all for this indicator. Then let's move over to the second indicator to adjust its settings. Double click on the super trend to bring up its settings. On the style, change the uptrend style to step lines with break. Also do the same for the downtrend. Make sure you uncheck this plot. Now head over to the inputs, change the time frame to 30, and also change the ATR length to 21, as well as changing the factor to 5. Click on the OK button to fully apply the settings. And for the last indicator on the chart, let's look at adjusting its settings. Bring up its settings panel, then untick the buy and sell label, as we do not need them for this strategy. And that would be all here. Now we have our chart looking like this. Please don't forget to smash that like button and hit the subscribe button. We're always sharing top-notch trading content, so you won't want to miss out. Are you ready to take your trading to new heights? Let's do this. For a buy signal to be valid, we need to follow four simple steps. First, we want our super trend to be green. This indicates we are in an upward direction. Who doesn't want to go up, right? Secondly, we would want to wait for our MACD histogram to cross below the zero line, while also waiting for the signal line below the zero line as well. This is a clear indication that the market is in our favor. When these two conditions are met, we would then look out for our third condition. And for that, we would wait till the MACD histogram closes inside the orange signal line. This is the time to take action. Finally, we need the candlestick to close above the alpha trend. 
This is the ultimate confirmation that it's time to make a move. Now, let's talk about stop loss and taking profit. For your stop loss, we would use the recent swing low, as it is the best area for a stop loss level. And for taking profit, we aim to look at 1.8 times what we risked in the market. This ensures that we make a profit while also minimizing risk. Continued. So make sure you take this serious trader. We see how we made 6 winning streaks using this MACD simple trading strategy. But wait, we're not done yet. Let's now go over the rules for a valid sell entry. First, we want our super trend to be red. This indicates we are in a downward direction. Secondly, we would want to wait for our MACD histogram to cross above the zero line while also waiting for the signal line above the zero line as well. When these two conditions are met, we would then look out for our third condition. And for that, we would wait till the MACD histogram closes inside the orange signal line. This is the time to make a move. Finally, we need the candlestick to close below the alpha trend. This is the ultimate confirmation that it's time to sell. So there you have it, a simple yet effective strategy for entering the market with confidence. Follow the rules just as it was stated, and you will see your account skyrocket. Don't forget to drop your thoughts about this strategy in the comment section below, and stay tuned for more videos on trading strategies. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.